Hi everyone, this is Sandro Forte again. Today we're going to talk about something I've had more emails and text messages about over the last three months than any other subject. And it is that wonderful subject of procrastination, everyone's worst enemy, of course. So here are five effective strategies, may I suggest, to avoid exactly that procrastination. So number one, break tasks into smaller steps. Dividing large tasks into manageable chunks makes them a lot less overwhelming and easier to start. Each small step can provide a sense of accomplishment, motivating, of course, you to continue with that task, process or objective. Number two, set specific goals and deadlines. That's really important because clearly defined goals with specific deadlines creates a sense of urgency and focus. So use tools like calendars or task management apps to keep track of that progress. Number three, eliminate distractions. Really important, uh, something that I struggle with on a regular basis. But the way I overcome that is to identify and then minimise those distractions in the environment. It might involve turning off notifications on a phone or laptop, setting specific times for social media or finding just a simple quiet workspace in which to focus. Number four, use something we call the Pomodoro technique. It basically involves working in short focus bursts, 20 to 25 minutes typically, followed by a short break. This particular method definitely improves concentration and over time prevents burnout. And lastly, probably most important of all, and as I've said many times before, when you achieve something, when you accomplish something, reward yourself. Establish a reward system for completing those tasks. Those rewards can be small treats, glass of wine, a trip to the golf course, breaks, any activity you enjoy. This positive reinforcement on a constant basis helps to maintain motivation. So there you go, the five top tips for avoiding procrastination. And of course, as always, wishing you all every continued success.